How can I sound like Brown Bird? Hello, we're listening to different sounds. What can you hear? Oh, I can hear a swishy sound. That's the wind blowing the leaves from the trees. That's a whistly sound. And I know what sound that is. Do you? It's Brown Bird. Hello, Brown Bird. You sound amazing. Yeah, she sounds sweet. Brown Bird's song makes me really happy. Better make the most of it, Jess. We won't be able to listen to her much longer. Why not? Because <laughs> it'll be winter soon. Then Brown Bird's got to fly somewhere warm. I'll miss that beautiful sound when she's gone. I know. We all will. <gasps> Maybe I could make a sound like Brown Bird. Then we could listen to it even when she isn't here. Cool. She makes a kind of whistly sound. Like this. Tweet, tweet, tweet. Tweet, tweet, tweet. Uh, not quite. That doesn't sound right. Hmm, how can I sound like Brown Bird? Hey, that's the big question! Who? Ask a lotta. What? Ask a lotta. Where? Ask a lotta. Why? Ask a lotta. Ask it, test it, find a way. Guess with Jess, come on, let's play. What's the question here today? How can I sound like Brown Bird? Brrr. I need to get some cosy moss for my stone. I'm going to the woods to collect some. See you soon, Jess. Good luck. Bye, Horace. Let's go and see Billy and Bar. They love listening to Brown Bird. Hmm. How to sound like Brown Bird? It's tricky, Jess. She sings so beautifully. Sings? <gasps> of course. Billy. Do you think if I sing, I'll sound like her? Oh, oh, I can sing. Listen. <clears throat> fa la 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 ba. <laughs> <laughs> I think you might need a little work, Fa. <laughs> Go on, Jess, you try. See if you can sing like Brown Bird. OK, here goes. Ba la 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 la! Ba la 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 la! Well? No, it's not the same. Bye, Brown Bird! If singing isn't the answer, what shall we try instead? We need someone who always has good ideas. <gasps> I know. She's pink, she lives at the hutch, and she's got big ears that are great for listening. Can you guess who it is? Is it Bar, Horace, or Mimi? It's Mimi, that's right. Let's go and see Mimi. Come on. Hmm. A sound like brown bird. Well... She does a kind of blowy thing with her beak, like this. Me, 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 me. <gasps> oh, dear. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. That wasn't the sound I was trying to make. <laughs> <laughs> Let me try. Tweet, tweet, tweet. Oh, that's it. Like a beak. Is Ruth like a beak? The uh, sort of. Make a blowy sound. <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> Ooh, the wind's so chilly. Let's go inside. Woohoo! Can I ride on the wheelbarrow? Yes! <sighs> I was warmer in your hat bar. <sighs> hey! Listen to the sound Billy's making. What? Like this? <sighs> She sounds like a bird. 
Let me try. Ah. <gasps> Hello, brown bird. Listen to this. <gasps> well? It's still not right. No, it's not. And I really want to answer the big question before Brown Bird leaves for winter. OK. Let's think about this. What sort of sound does Brown Bird make? Mm. <gasps> A pretty yeah. sound. A pretty whistly sound. Hey, the wind was making a sort of whistly sound this morning. Where did you hear it, Jess? Hmm. Can you remember where we heard the whistly sound? It was when I was with Horace. Was it by the pond, near the twisty tree, or in Buttercup Meadow? By the pond! Brilliant! Let's go back to the pond. Catch me if you can. Not here. Listen, there's the whistly sound. Oh, it sounds so pretty. Just like Brown Bird. It sounds like. like lots of Brown Birds singing at the same time. You're right. And it's coming from the reeds. I can't make that sound, though. I'm not a reed. <sighs> Got all the moss I need now. Horace! Oh, hello. There you are. We were looking for you. Hello. I've been trying all day to sound like brown bird. We've tried singing. And making hooty sounds. And we found whistly reeds at your pond. But I still can't make the sound myself. Can you help? whoop de whoop Course I can. Wait till you. Perfect. Uh, how does this make a sound like brown bird? It's easy. The wind was blowing through the reeds, and that's what makes the whistly sound. So, pretend to be the wind. Huh? Like this? to sound just like brown bird. And we've answered the question. Yippity-yay, 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 hooray! Hey, 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 yippity-yay. We got with Jess today. We followed the clues. We put it to the test. We tried our best and then we guessed. Sing it. Hey, hey, yippity-yay. Here's the answer. Hooray! I made the whistle sound of brown bird by blowing through a reed. Perhaps you could try and make different sounds too, like this. <laughs> Come and help me answer another question soon. Bye. <laughs> Where's my feather gone? Bird? She's my friend. I see her almost every morning. <gasps> Look! She left a beautiful feather behind. <laughs> I'm playing feather chase. <laughs> Puppies. Jess, do you want to come and play tail chase? <laughs> Maybe later. I'm playing with my feather right now. What feather? 
<laughs> my blue and yellow one. Oh, no! It was here a moment ago. Where's my feather gone? Hey, that's the big question. <laughs> Ask a lot of... What? Ask a lot of... Ask a lot of... Ask a lot of... Ask it, test it, find a way. Guess which yes, come on, let's play. What's the question here today? Where's my feather gone? Jinx, we'll look for it in the whispering woods. Okay, bye. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. See you later. Hmm. Can't have gone that far. Whoa! <laughs> oh, Jess, are you all right? Yes, thanks. I was looking for my lovely feather. I was playing feather chase with it, and now it's gone. Oh. Where was it last time you saw it? Um, it was there, bouncing around in the wind. <gasps> Look, the wind's blowing the leaves all the way to Buttercup Meadow. Hmm. Hey, maybe it blew my feather over there too. Maybe. Let's go and see. Are you coming too? Have you seen my blue and yellow feather? Did it blow into the meadow? Um... Uh-uh. No. Sorry, Jess. Oh. Oh! <laughs> Where did that come from? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> from Ba! It's a bit of his wool. Bits are always coming off. On the fence and branches and things. <laughs> it's a good thing you've got so much wool to spare, Bar. <gasps> Jess, maybe if we knew where your feather came from, then it might give us a clue where it's gone. Good idea, Mimi. So, where did my feather come from? From Willow? From Bar? Or from Little Bird? From Little Bird! Yes! Have you two seen her anywhere? Um, no. Not today, Jess. Sometimes there's a blue and yellow bird in the tree by Horace's pond. Really? Great! Come on, Mimi. Let's go to the pond. Little bird so beautiful She sings the sweetest song Sing. <gasps> Horace, have you seen Little Bird? Yep, I was just playing along with some. They were in their little homes, those nests, see? Where? Up there. Oh, those are brown birds. Yes, and my friend Little Bird's blue and yellow. Oh, I know her. She sits and sings here sometimes. Haven't seen her today, though. Hmm. How am I going to find her and find out where my feather's gone? Hmm. Do you know where she lives? In a tree. Hmm. If a little bird's nest isn't in this tree... Then it must be in another one. Yes! <gasps> there are lots of trees in the Whispering Woods. Let's look there. Brilliant, Jess. Bye, Bye Horace. Stay cool. Jess? No. <laughs> Hello, you 
you two. You haven't found my feather, have you? <laughs> no, sorry, Jess. We found some of Bar's wool, though. We've been playing wool chase. You throw it up in the air and then catch it. It's brilliant. Oh, never mind. Let's play tail chase instead. You're it. <laughs> Bar didn't want his wool back, but what if Little Bird wanted her feather back? But why would she? Oh, Jess, look! There she is! Oh, yes! But what's she doing with Bar's wool? Quick, follow her! I wonder why she's putting Bar's wool into her nest. Maybe she's making it all warm and cosy, like a blanket. Twigs wouldn't be very warm on their own. <laughs> You're right. I suppose birds use anything warm they can find. Yes. I wonder what sort of things. What else would keep a nest nice and warm? A pine cone, a leaf or a feather? A feather! Maybe Little Bird's put her feather into her nest. I think she wants you to go up and have a look. It's here! Now I know where my feather's gone. And we've answered the question. Yippity yay, yippity yay, yippity yay! has gone into Little Bird's nest to keep it warm and cosy. I'm sorry you can't play feather chase, Jess. I don't mind. Little Bird needs her feather to keep warm. <laughs> Tail chase! <laughs> Coming to get you! <laughs> Look out for feathers, won't you? And see how many different colours you can spot. Come and help me answer another question soon. <laughs> Bye! <laughs> How can I go up and down on the seesaw? <laughs> Hello! Billy and Bar are making something to play with. It's something that goes up and down. It's a seesaw! <laughs> I can't wait! Let's go! <laughs> wow, it's fantastic! I'll go on this end. OK, we'll go on that end. I've never done seesawing before. Well, now is your chance, Bar. <laughs> it's great! Hurry up, Bar. Whee! <laughs> What happens now? Oh, it should go up and down. I shouldn't be stuck like this. How can I go up and down on the seesaw? <gasps> hey, that's the big question. Who? Ask a lot of what? Ask a lot of where? Ask a lot of why? Ask a lot of ask it, test it, find a way. Guess with Jess, come on, let's play. What's the I go up and down on the seesaw. Push down with your bottom, Jess. OK. It won't budge. Maybe it's broken. You two climb off and we'll see if it's still stuck. Oh. Whoa! Oh. <laughs> Sorry, Jess. Are you OK? Yeah, I'm fine. Hmm, it can definitely move, so it isn't stuck. But I can't go up and down on it. 
Perhaps we should find something else that goes up and down. Yes, then we can work out how to make the seesaw go up and down too. Who can we ask? I know. Can you guess who it is? He's green, he lives at the pond and is always jumping up and down. Is it Mimi, Horace or Willow? Horace, brilliant! <laughs> Let's go to the pond and see Horace. Are you coming too? Come on! Hoo-hoo! Look what I've made. Come on everybody and gather around and Let's learn about up and down Going up, 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 up Going up, jump and hop ooh, ooh, Till I reach the top, up, 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 up. Coming up to the top of the world When you reach the top, where do you go from there? I go down, I'm going down, 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 down Whee! <laughs> <laughs> you know lots about going up and down, Horace Sure do Can you help me answer my big question? We've got a seesaw and we're trying to work out why my side only goes up, not down. Can you help? Hmm. I don't know much about seesaws. Sorry, Jess. Hey, Mimi likes hopping up and down. Maybe she knows something about seesaws. That's a great idea. Enjoy your slide, Horace. Come on. Mimi, what are you doing? The tap's broken, so I'm filling my watering can from the water barrel. Then I can water my carrots. Uh, would you help? Yes, what do I do? You hold onto the rope and I'll lower the can down into the water. And now we pull it up. <laughs> <laughs> hey! Another thing that's going up and down! And it's given me an idea! Mimi, please can we borrow your rope? My rope? Yes! Why? You'll see! Come on! Now, Mimi! Pull! <sighs> oh, hey! A seesaw! We love seesaws! I can't pull it down on my own. We'll help. One, two, three, pull! Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> we did it! Yay! Huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh no, this isn't working. How can I make the seesaw go up and down? Can we have a turn? Our turn! Our turn! <laughs> <laughs> How can Joey and Jinx go up and down, but we can't? I don't know. This is a mystery. Hmm. Now, who haven't we asked for help? Well... <gasps> Willow! Of course! Willow's really clever. She's bound to know the answer. Let's go. <laughs> Hi, Willow. What's this? These are my scales. I'm giving my two nephews a bag of horse nuts each. I'm weighing them on the scales to make sure they both get exactly the same amount. Does this remind you of anything? That's right. It's like my seesaw. Willow, how do the scales work? <laughs> Watch this. Can you see that each side of the scales is even now? Yes. <gasps> Does that mean the bags on each side weigh the same? Exactly. They're evenly balanced. But what happens if the different sides of the scales are different weights? <laughs> I'll show you. So now 
Now this side is heavier. Do you think the seesaw didn't work for Bar, Billy and me? Because Bar and Billy together are heavier than me. That's it. Well done, Jess. Do you think the seesaw worked for Joey and Jinx because they're about the same weight? Yes. Uh-huh. So all I need to do is find someone who weighs about the same as me. Hmm. Who might weigh about the same as me? Someone who's about the same size as me, perhaps. Is it me and Billy? Me and Horace? Or me and Mimi? Me and Mimi! That's right! Thanks! balance each other out. Now I just push down like this. <sighs> then push up like this. <laughs> this is fun! <laughs> <laughs> it works! We're going up and down. And we've answered the question. Yippity yay, yippity yay, yippity yay! go up and down by finding someone who weighs about the same as me to seesaw with. <laughs> Maybe the next time you go to a park, you can have fun on a seesaw too. <laughs> <laughs> Come and help me answer another question soon. Bye! <laughs> <laughs>